A dinosaur exhibit coming through Erie this weekend. The family-friendly event is full of life-sized dinos and ancient ocean dwellers. Fontaine Glenn's at the Bayfront Convention Center. She has more on this event. Good morning, Fontaine. Good morning, Dave. And Erie has been invaded by dinosaurs, or at least the Bayfront Convention Center for Jurassic Quest. And to talk more about why I'm surrounded by dinosaurs and what Jurassic Quest is, is Caleb Hughes. Good morning, Caleb. Good morning. So tell me, what is Jurassic Quest? Well, Jurassic Quest is where the big dinosaurs live. You, your friends, and your fellow dinosaur lovers will be able to come to Jurassic Quest, travel back in time to the early Triassic period, about 251 million years, where you'll not just view dinosaurs, but also ride dinosaurs, bounce in bounce houses, dig for fossils, and so much more. Gotcha. And I know it's ha today's the first day, but tell me more about those dates. Absolutely. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday is when we're open to the public from 9 a.m. And when we close, varies per day. So we encourage all of our guests to go to JurassicQuest.com. There they'll not just view our hours, but can purchase their time slots, which we strongly encourage our guests to do before they go extinct. And what sets this um, experience apart from maybe other events that come to Erie? Oh, absolutely. Well, in addition to all of our dinosaurs being life-size, uh, we've worked alongside paleontologists to make sure that all of our dinosaurs are uh, done correctly in painstaking detail, up to date with the, the latest facts on dinosaurs. It's really an awesome event, not just for the whole family, but even just as adults, you can rediscover your childlike imagination and sense of wonder by rediscovering your interest in dinosaurs. Now, your actual title is a dinosaur trainer, so and when you're with the kids, they're dinosaur trainers in training, right? Yes, yeah, so that, that is the goal is to help train up young scientists. Uh, so one of my spiels is that we are training young dinosaur trainers. And there are two main key factors when becoming a dinosaur trainer, and that is fearlessness and kindness. Um, you guys will have the opportunity to pet some of our dinosaurs. We just ask that you please be gentle. And then, of course, when dealing with dinosaurs or any dangerous predator, it's, it's important to be fearless. All right. Well, thanks so much, Caleb. And Caleb won't be going too far. He'll be hanging out with us the rest of the morning. And we're going to go and check out some more stuff that you can see uh, for the Jurassic Quest. Dave, back to you. All right, Fontaine. And I do want to clarify, folks, those sounds we were hearing were from the dinosaur, not my stomach because I haven't eaten breakfast yet this morning. All right, thank you, Fontaine.